Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who liked, watched and subscribed to my channel and my last video. I really, really do appreciate it and I'm so thankful that you're all so kind. Um, so yeah, I really hope you enjoy this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more. So today's video is going to be all about the Wisp Bear which is this little bear right here. He's super, super cute. And um, I was kindly given this wisp bear to review and see how I got on with it. Um, and personally, I actually can't live without it now. Um, I have you and the dream sheep for Jude and he can't live without that. He's had that since he was born. And um, Jesse has now this. He's had it for, um, so he's five months. I think he got this when he was about two months. Um, and for the first two months, he was very sleepy and quiet anyway, Jesse. But as he got older, um, especially now, he's much more like vocal. He's more aware when I'm not in the room and things like this. And he's more aware when you're not cuddling him off to sleep and things. So this whisper has honestly, honestly helped me. Like it is going to be coming on holiday with me. It comes in the car with me. It comes in the pushchair with me. It has like little magnetic um, legs that literally you can bend and clip onto anything um, as well as the fact that it is obviously like a humming bear and um, it is a sensory toy it has little like ears make little crackly noises and the colours of its legs um, and it's super cute and I like this bear a lot because of the fact that it is amazing and it does what it actually says it's going to do which is refreshing because when you're a parent you can it's so easy to get sucked in to buy in everything recommended in gurgle magazine or something um because other people have recommended it and said it's good but it doesn't always actually work but this really really does work um so yeah it can be a sensory toy and it's a humming bear and also i like the fact that it's not too childish to look at i know it sounds a bit silly but i'm not one for like toys that are every colour of the rainbow like Jesse has toys that are every colour of the rainbow of course he does and Jude did as well but just as something to take out with you that's not such like an eyesore or something I know it sounds a bit silly but it just matches everything nice and easy um personally for me because everything in my house is like white black or grey um that I do have colour um but no I just I really like the look of it and I like the design of it I like the fact that you can take it out, it has just some batteries. Um, I have had the same batteries in this bear for probably like three months um, and they're still working fine. I mean, it's a little bit more quiet now because the batteries are dying. I need to put new ones in. But um, yeah, I really like it. So the bear makes a noise of the womb um, and it has a, it goes on for 40 minutes and then it has a cryo sensor like activation. So basically, when you put it on, it goes on for 40 minutes so your baby can like hear the noise and fall to sleep nicely. And then if your baby cries in the night or like starts to stir, it hears this noise and it instantly turns itself on. And this has to be the ama most amazing feature about this. Like it's annoying that other like things like this don't have this feature um, because this has got to be the best. Um, so Jesse, this will go off. Jesse's like right next to me at night and he will like whinge a little bit and this bear will go off and he will go like mm, straight back to sleep it's so so good and I actually didn't have it one night I left it at my mum's house and I noticed the difference Jesse I must have got up like eight times just to put the dummy in his mouth like he didn't settle back off easily he would be like awake for short periods of time so I think this bear truly does work um and it's made by mums, so I think that's great because mums know what their child needs and they know what to like invent more than just like a company that's for oh let's create another bear that makes a noise or something like that. Like they know and they definitely got it right. Um, other things about the bear, other than the fact that it looks super cute and it's so easy and practical, is that you can actually take the um like the noise machine out and wash the bear which I find really handy and um, as I love 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 Ewan but Ewan's very difficult to wash because you have to just like wipe him clean or spot clean him because he's all connected um, 
but this you just squeeze him he goes on and off and you can take that out to completely wash the bear um has a little toggle at the top here so if you wanted to hang it from something you could hang it um also the noise on this isn't as annoying as I thought it was going to be because he only makes one noise which is the only downside I find to whisper but the noise he makes is great and it definitely works um it's just the fact that he only makes one noise which I think would be awesome if he could make more noises um but yeah he um what's I saying you can take it out and wash it he makes the noise oh the noise so the noise isn't isn't bad like Ewan I used to have Ewan next to me because Jude was next to me at night and um Jude always liked the particular like womb noise on Ewan that had the heartbeat with it um and that wasn't ever an issue I could fall asleep with that and this as well the same not a no not an annoying noise you know I don't even notice it when it's on and I generally can fall asleep with it literally right next to me because Jesse is in his snooze pod which is adjacent to my bed so he was <laughs> bear is literally like this close to my head um, so yeah, personally, I love the bear. I can't recommend it enough. Um, it's not something that's just for babies. Like, Jesse will probably have it as an actual bear, like, to snuggle, like, Jude still has Ewan, even though Jude, Ewan has no batteries in at the moment. <laughs> um, Jude will still, like, press his feet, like, Mummy, Ewan, and I'm like, I know I need to get batteries, but Jude will still, like, cuddle Ewan, and, like, he calls him sheepy. And he'll take Sheepy everywhere with him. And Jude's nearly three. So I think Jesse will probably do the same with this Whisper. Um, and it's like it's light. It's not heavy. Um, it doesn't take up too much room in a baby bag. And you don't even need to keep it in your baby bag because you can just attach it to anything. Push chair, car seat, whatever. Um, so yeah, and it's, again, like, I know it sounds silly, but it's not like such an eyesore toy like your little baby or a toddler to be walking around carrying like Ewan as well Ewan's like lovely white and grey I don't think they need to be too colourful like because things like this they're mainly there to create a noise to soothe your baby which is the purpose which is what you want them to do and like then your baby can have a million other toys that are colourful and pretty and have dangly things and make loads of noises to play with so yeah I don't think you should let the fact that it's more modern put you off of buying it if anything, buy more. <laughs> um, yeah, I love the Waste Bear. And you can check out their website for more information. Um, I'll leave a link below. I also have a giveaway running on my Instagram at the moment, which finishes Tuesday at 9 pm to win one of these in collaboration with Waste Bear. And um, if you search at Rachel underscore Francis, I should come up and I'll leave a link to that in the description box as well. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, if you have any comments on the whisper, then feel free to comment down below because I'm sure other mums will want to see as well if you like it, if you don't like it. Um, yeah, and just check out their website and Instagram for more information. Thanks!